pit. That's why <coughs> Mount Sissons was created, because companies were fleeing the state because of our exposure to hurricanes. Um, in 2005, we started having sinkhole fraud, and we're going to talk about that in a minute. Since homeowners are such a challenge, you must, must have all the good companies that have a good rating. Now, I want to talk about Sissons. They are the number one company out there. If they're the number one, sure. The last poll that we're at, 21% of all the homeowners in the state of Florida. Um, it was, uh, I forget how many millions of customers they have. They're currently under um, depopulation. Depopulation means they're trying to um, give their business out to other companies. That's actually a good thing because citizens this year absolutely just changed their entire um, uh, homeowner's policy. Um, what she's passing around here is, I, I ran a homeowner's quote over here in Covington, and it just shows you we have every company on this list. There's actually 10 companies that are not on this list because they're not in this rating system. But that just kind of shows you how many companies out there are rating in this area. Um, with citizens, if they say something, you better pay attention because everybody follows citizens insurance. They were supposed to be insured of last resort. What's happening is State Farm and Allstate only have a few companies besides citizens. So there are clients out there that are being sold citizens because it is their last resort. That is their last company to have. They don't have any other companies. Citizens, when they changed their uh, coverages, they went to basically no longer covering pool um, cages. A lot of houses in the state of Florida have pools. Those pool cages range from anywhere from ten to twenty to thirty thousand dollars for aluminum for the screen enclosure. So that's no longer covered. If you have a detached a structure, a shed, no longer covered. Their liability limits, they were reduced from 300000 to 100000 So now on the, your upper salon customers that have a million dollar umbrella, now they have to get gap insurance. You know, that used to be for cars. Now there's gap insurance if you have a citizen's policy. Also, their uh, personal property percentage dropped from 50% to 25%. That could be a huge deal if you have a small house. If you have a $500,000 house and you have um, you know, 250000 personal property at 50%, that's way plenty normally for most houses. Um, birthday girl, you pass off the sinkhole forms. So as my sales force, 